Hi guys. I am not in the Dollar General, in case you're interested. <laughs> I am in my new Dollar Tree slash Family Dollar Store. And uh, since they're a little bit more stocked and a little bit more ready to go, I thought we'd do another little tour around and have a look at some of the things that you can get there. And uh, the great thing about it is, this is Dollar Tree merchandise. Okay, now some of these things we can get at the Dollar General for a dollar. Okay, but some of these things we can't. And uh, the great thing about this is you still get to use a Family Dollar Smart Coupon for 5 off of 25 on Saturday, even on these items. So, yes, a great smart way to shop. And look at some of these awesome things guys I mean I'm just saying for even a dollar and 25 cent I mean things I mean spring's coming so keep that in mind you get paint trays things to redo your cabinets um, I mean these things cost four and five dollars if you get them at the hardware store look we've got some totally aw awesome oxygen like uh you know oxygen cleaner for a dollar and 25 cent we don't have that at the dollar general we have big bottles of dollar and 25 cent bleach we don't have that at the dollar general and some of the craft items are absolutely awesome picture frames for a dollar and twenty-five cent, you're not going to get this for a dollar and twenty-five cent at Dollar General. You're going to pay four and five dollars for. It. I'm sorry, at yeah, at Dollar General, you're going to pay four and five dollars for something as simple as this. Okay, and of course you can dress this up any way you want, but for a dollar and twenty-five cent, yes, little accent mirrors. And of course, greeting cards. And we might have even gotten into the spring stuff. I mean, look at look at the triple pot for a dollar and twenty-five cent. You're not going to get that that Dollar General. Okay, these number balloons. I was just at Dollar General. Two days ago looking at number balloons they are two dollars uh for the cheapest number balloon that they have they are dollar 25 here oh my gosh look at this dentist kit for your kids holy moly <laughs> this is something else i've seen the doctor kits that's really cute but now you can Get your kids to want to be a dentist. I mean, really, I'm not trying to be funny. That's a great way to instill something in your kids. That's a cute little doll for a dollar and twenty-five cent, and this one too. And they don't appear to be super cheap. So yeah guys, oh my gosh, who remembers these? But look, they're different now. Ankle skippers are a dollar and twenty-five cent. <laughs> yeah, this is an awesome little toy to get your kids and it's exercise. Just saying. Hot Wheels tracks. Come on. Hot Wheels tracks, guys, for a dollar and twenty-five cents a piece. Yeah. And then, of course, you go to Dollar General and get your Hot Wheels. Because you got to have the real deal Hot deal, hot Wheels. Now, what I'm discovering, uh, since we now have a Family Dollar in the vicinity, is that the Family Dollar uh, deals and prices are pretty similar to the Dollar General. So, you know how we uh, worry about getting two or three scenarios at your local Dollar General 
or you only might have one account but there's some really good deals out there that you would like to do more than once well if you got a family dollar close by get you a family dollar account because most all of our deals that we do at Dollar General can be switched over to Family Dollar using the Family Dollar Smart Coupons, digital coupons. Like I said, and in some instances may even be cheaper. Like I said, look, they have items that Dollar General does not have. I love the big blue rug. I really do like the blue rug. I think the rugs are $30. 29 and 30. Well, this great big one is 25. But I really kind of like the blue. <laughs> one thing, it's just got a lot of white in it, and that won't work at my house. The light colors. There we go. That's what I was trying to see what it actually looked like. That's pretty cool. And like I said, different products but in the same price range. Hmm. What is this? Well, it's just a new type of packaging for Bounty, and this is a 6 for 12. Okay, I need to... I do know they have a Paul Mollith coupon for 75 cent. And it looks like their cheapest Paul Mollith, besides the 125 up top, is going to be 350. So 75 cents off is going to make it 275. So And the Febreze is three twenty-five, which I understand our Febreze is going to be going up to three fifty at the Dollar General. And uh, they seem to have quite a lot of cents, and everything is stocked. And they also have the two dollar and thirty cent on Febreze. So if you have a cent here. That you like that's not at your store, you could pick it up. Such as that Febreze Light Air Sea Spray. I have not seen that at Dollar General. Okay, let's talk about the bread products at the Family Dollar compared to Dollar General. You've got more of a variety. You've got uh, some muffins. They're American Classic. I've already had the American Classic Plain Pound Cake. That was pretty good for $1.50. Uh, for $1.50, it was actually awesome. Um, but you can see we have more variety of breads and the bread prices are cheaper. Three fifty for the Nature's Own. We even have uh, some Hawaiian Nature's Own. We have some of those super expensive and not worth the money bouncers. <laughs> oh, and look, we've got a new Mrs. Fleshland peanut butter covered cupcake. So, like I keep saying, different items about the same price point or cheaper. But it's definitely an alternative to go uh, for a 5 off 25 or to use your digital coupons. Okay. Um, now, here's the instance where Dollar General is cheaper. These are $6.50 at Dollar General and you have a dollar off. They are $7.25 here. So there will be some instances where it is cheaper okay and then let's talk about this this is $6.95 at Dollar General it is $5.95 here so where the creamer is more expensive the coffee is cheaper so it balances out 
that's the same price for the cappuccino. But look, we've got these cappuccino sticks instance for a dollar. You get four in here for a dollar. Instant cappuccinos. And this is Folgers. This is good stuff, guys. Huh. Yeah, we're going to throw that in our buggy. Oh, and individual Klondike bars. Okay, what would you do for Klondike? <laughs> would you go to Family Dollar? Because they have the individual ones, and I'm going to get one, and I'm going to get up out of here. Um, there wasn't a whole lot in here that I needed. I just wanted to see how they were coming with their stocking of the shells and what other items that they got in. So if you've got one of those new hybrid, then you might want to go check it out. Because I think that it will save you money. And uh, just as much as Dollar General, if not more. So blessings. We'll talk again real soon. Because we got more deals, steals, and glitches to talk about. And uh, I'm going to try to get you a family dollar scenario going. That will be similar to some of what we're doing at the Dollar General. Alrighty. Alright guys, this is my little deal. <laughs> from uh, Family Dollar. I got me a spring water for 95 cents. I got the Folgers for a dollar. I got a sheet gripper contraption for a dollar and 25 cents. Those are the things you put on your sheets to keep your sheets from slipping. Because I actually need that. I got me a chocolate milk and uh, a Klondike bar. Keep in mind, it's just me. So, yeah, this is quite a lot for one person. <laughs> but I got one, two, three, four, five items for $6.95. Um, that's going to equal out to like a dollar and 25 cent or close per item. So, not bad, considering we tried to stay within our dollar range, but like I said, if we can do a dollar twenty-five or less, we're happy, especially these days. So, there you go, guys. Go to your family dollar, check it out, and do your scenarios just like you do them at Dollar General, and save twice the money. Blessings.